For our paratransit drivers, each day brings a new set of challenges and satisfaction. Our most successful drivers come to work prepared. They're up early to check the day's weather report so they know what's in store. Once they arrive at work, they check in with dispatch to receive their assignment and take the time to review posted notices to stay current. Professional paratransit drivers don't like surprises. Their responsibility is too great to take chances. Safety is their number one priority, which means each day starts with a thorough pre-trip inspection before they leave the yard to make sure the paratransit vehicle they're driving is in top mechanical condition. Then it's off to the first pickup. To succeed as a paratransit driver, you'll need to be comfortable helping seniors and people with disabilities. You'll most likely have ongoing interactions with passengers you carry. That means our ideal driver is a people person. Working with seniors and people with disabilities can be a very rewarding experience for the right person. But these rewards come with some serious responsibilities. There are three serious considerations you need to be aware of. First, driving people with disabilities requires additional training. Many of your passengers will be boarding with mobility devices. You must learn to operate passenger lifts, securement devices, and other types of equipment. If you're intimidated by using this type of equipment, this might not be the career for you. Second, you'll have to be more physically involved with the passengers. You may have to lift them or hold them in place while you fasten seat belts. It requires a lot of patience, a constantly positive, caring attitude, and a desire to work with and help others. The job can be both physically and emotionally demanding. If you're not up for that, this isn't the right job for you. While operating the vehicle, you should always apply safe driving principles. However, when transporting seniors and people with disabilities, this is especially important. Most mobility device related injuries to passengers can be traced to driver errors such as abrupt stops and evasive maneuvers. As I said earlier, working with seniors and people with disabilities is a tremendous responsibility, but for the right person, it's the most rewarding job around. Not all encounters will be easy. From time to time, you may run into problems, accidents, bad weather, mechanical failures, passengers who won't accept your help. We'll look to you to deal with these situations, to solve the problems that can be solved, and to refer the ones that can to your supervisor or dispatch. We'll expect you to apply the training you received to arrive at the best possible solution. If you aren't comfortable dealing with the responsibilities on this level, you might not be comfortable or successful working as a paratransit driver. Fortunately, these situations are the exception and not the rule. But you need to feel comfortable interacting in a pleasant way with the passengers. It takes a special kind of person to do this job. Someone who views situations as opportunities rather than looking at them as potential problems. At the end of the day, paratransit drivers head back to the lot and perform a post-trip inspection. This involves walking through the vehicle to make sure it's still in top condition and to check for lost items. Afterwards, it's just a few minutes to catch up on paperwork, to report any mechanical problems, check the schedule, and it's time to go home. A career as a paratransit driver for MV Transportation gives you the opportunity to provide safe, reliable, and efficient transportation to the community. Not everybody is comfortable with that much responsibility. If you're the type of person who is more at ease simply taking orders and doing the same thing every day, then you might not be happy or successful working as a paratransit driver. But if you're the type of person who wants the opportunity to succeed, to learn and grow, to take responsibility, and to interact with the community, then this could be the end of your career search.